Winter weather travel advisory, uh, including Toronto and down over the north shore of Lake Erie to the south end of Lake Huron. Uh, the area that are seeing the warnings or the areas are seeing the warnings, Hamilton and northern Niagara, including St. Catharines, and that's because they're expected to see uh, upwards of 20 centimeters there. That's because the easterly wind picking up moisture off Lake Ontario uh, will be providing that extra little bit. You can see that in white. Areas shaded in gray, uh, that's where we're going to get four to eight centimeters of snow for Toronto and up to 15 for southwest. Western Ontario, uh, depending on exactly where you are. So I think if you're traveling west or southwest, that's where you're going to run into more challenging driving conditions. If you're going north, especially northeast, it will be less impactful because we'll be further away from the center of that low pressure. Your wind chill, uh, it requires a thicker jacket. I think the hat and the gloves, especially if you have a ride or waiting or waiting for a ride or on a platform this morning. And you can see the system snow already in southwestern and midwestern Ontario, and it is just pushing closer and closer to Toronto. So by 11, I think we'll start to see those flakes fly lightly, but blowing around, reducing visibility. It's not the storm of last week, that's for sure, but still requires a little bit of forethought and care out there. Tomorrow, breaks in the cloud egg zero, and then a few late-day flurries on Sunday into Monday.